get started. I'm looking forward to take you into the movement piece where we focused a little bit upon the fascial pelvic floor in combination with the training of the lumbar dorsal fascial tissues. And I'm going to just take you into easy balances and for sure into fascial stretches. And we're going to finish up with um, a gentle breath for release and refinement. And just at the very end, maybe you want to just take a cushion or make yourself comfortable in a chair to finish up with. So let's just get into all fours. And you place the hands below your shoulders and make sure the dorsal part of your foot is touching the ground. And then you just elongate your sitting bones backwards, you lift the sternum a little bit, and it just throughout the elongation. Just do a little bit of a catapult action in front. You elevate the sitting bones and you do just a couple of those easy bounces backwards before you catapult yourself into the front. Let's give it a try. So that with the preparatory counter movement, you really engage that back part of your pelvic floor throughout elevating the sitting bones and very easy. That's the last one for now. And then you shift the toes and you bring the toes and tuck them into the ground. Now we do the knee lift. has also a catapulting action and that comes from the Achilles tendon and the spinniness of your plantar fascia. So you want to do this one. So it's like four. Right? Yeah. So you, the knee is lifting throughout the action of your lower leg and your pelvis stays low. So you do a couple of those. You do three more. You get yourself back and we just do the part with the elongation after sitting bones again. Make sure you're really elevating first and then you catapult yourself in front. And you can get a little bit more up into the front. Okay, great. Last one to go. You take the leg and one leg and really elevate it out. You want to make sure that you lower the heel throughout that kind of really explosive kind of a move move of the heel and the back line again. So it's actually a little bit the same thing. So we do the lifting throughout this nice kind of rebound. And then you take both legs backwards and we get ourselves into a plank position. And we just walk on the spot with the same emphasis Heel is really lower. <laughs> yeah. Yep. Three, two, one. Get back, get down, and hit and bounce. Now we're taking the right sitting bone and you push the front part of your foot before you catapult yourself in front. Shift upon and onto the left side. So the sitting bone is elongating. You're catapulting yourself in front throughout a little bit of a push down as the dorsal part of your foot. You get back down here and then we do that nice kind of rebound and you want to really engage your fascia belt from the transverses into your number of dorsal fascial tissues. Up, back, three, two, one, down. 